Yeah. Good try. Oh, okay, if you if you open it up a quarter of a turn is start, and then another quarter turn is run. Mm -hmm. So it it may you may you may. I don't think there's no gas up there. Well, it's got a lot more now. Okay, open that up one turn, a quarter. You see, I don't, I don't think it had no gas up there. Still yet? Mm -mm. I think that was that. When all else fails. Huh? Let's see. See, that engine should have started already by now. So, I don't think there's fuel up there. Oh, you think the check valve is stuck? No, I just don't think it's sucking fuel. You took some gas and stirred it down in this mixer right here and started. See, it popped off. We put that oil in there and it, start, it started to run that oil. You should be smelling gas, so you don't even smell it. Let's squirt some down there and I should, we'll see. Let's see. Is it sucking? Yeah. Hmm? What's it? Yeah, it's okay. Lift it up there. Backwards. It ain't gonna be much. If it is any. Oh, you ain't got none in there. It's gone for it, got down the side of the can. You want to kick it? Uh, let's give it one more. One more seal belt before we do it. I mean, that's always an option. But not knowing about this coil 100%. Uh, okay, see, the engine could not have run what? with this spark plug. What? Wet? Yeah. Oily. It's got a drop of oil between the electrodes. So... <laughs> Had we done anything else to the engine other than to take this out, mm -hmm. would have been for Neil. Also, this one is the same way. Mm -hmm. See, the engine could not have run. Yeah, too much oil. So, you know, that, that's the kind of questions that you can't answer. From them, them guys on Harry's old engine... This is the kind of problems that they have with their engines, and you can't you can't convince the man to do to do this, to take them out. Bring it here, let's let's blow you it. You know, out. see the first instinct there was the poor. Was to take something apart. So,
Now, I kind of think that probably could open up the gap a little bit under the circumstances. Because I think that, that that spark that we that we got was uh, it was pretty robust. You, do you agree? Well, if that was the case, it ain't gonna matter really. Huh? If it was robust, it really ain't gonna matter then. We went through that oil. Oh, we done lost them up. Yeah. Uh, well, no, no, no. It wasn't that robust. Oh, okay. No, no, the ignition was, the fire was, you know, it was a loud report, but it was only one. Because immediately it got this oil in here when it fired. Right, right. Yeah, you know, so. It, it couldn't do it again. If it had been able to do it again, it would have ran. For some more than one. Don't ask me why I was doing that. I don't we have to. It, it did. Um, I think it's been painted on it. The flywheel? Yeah. Maybe. Don't that look like a gloss? Uh, it's at, right there. It's at what, whatever it's on. Like yeah. Oh, okay, give her a go again. You think it got more oil on the spark plug? Yep. Uh, it's wet, but it's not bridged. Uh, I believe that's gas wet there. Thin, you know, thin. What was it? Well, see, that one's wet. This one ain't. You know, it don't look like it's got nothing. Maybe some vapors. It looks like it's got vapors on it. Oh. Uh, but I don't think it, that's, that, that's not what the reason it ain't running. This one wouldn't. Uh, this one... Would it would have ran with a robust spark? But see, them two little ignitions, they they didn't sound as robust as the first one did. It wasn't as explosive. Mm -hmm. But if it would run just a little bit, I think it would run in real good. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Improve as it runs. It's got new rings in it. Yeah. Okay. You want to kick it? If you want to. Just a little bit more that way. What do you mean? 